Hello, we are going to make a flower. Inflate any lovely color balloon leaving up to 3 inch flat tail. We are going to make two sets of petals. I want to make all bubbles a bit soft. So let's squeeze the balloon to make it soft. Make sure to leave at least one inch flat tail at the end of the balloon. First we make a set of three long petals and then we make set of three short petals. The size of the long petal is one quarter of the balloon. So let's fold the balloon four times to find the size. Mark the point starting from the nozzle. Here it is. Twist the chain of first two bubbles. Lock both ends of the chain of the first two bubbles in one lock twist. Fold the balloon to measure the third bubble and twist it. Lock the free end of the third bubble between the first and the second bubbles. We have made a set of three large petals. The size of the short petal is one third of the rest of the balloon. Fold the rest of the balloon three times to find the size. Twist the chain of the next two bubbles. It's important to have at least a quarter inch uh, flat tail at the end of the balloon to lock the bubbles. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Here I purposely keep no flat tail at the end of the balloon. So now I have to twist one small extra bubble at the end of the balloon. To lock the bubbles. Now we lock the free end of the sixth bubble between the fourth and the fifth bubbles. I do it with a bird body twist. Or we can roll the seventh small bubble between the fourth and the fifth bubble. The result will be the same. We have made a set of three short petals. Let's hide the seventh bubble between the short petals. Now we have to fix the set of three short petals inside of the set of three long petals. We have made the blossom. Here's the side view, the top view and the bottom view. We need a stem and we can make a stem with a different number of leaves. For the stem, inflate a green balloon leaving up to 3 inch flat tail. Tie the nozzle of the green balloon at the bottom of the blossom. Make sure to hide the green nozzle between red bubbles. Ok, we have made the flower with the stem. Let's add couple leaves to the stem. Twist the first green about 6-7 inch bubble. Let's squeeze the balloon to make uh, leaves bubbles soft. We need no flat tail at the end of the balloon. Twist about 7 inch bubble at the end of the green balloon. Lock both ends of the second green bubble in one lock twist. We have made one big leaf. We can use it just like that. Or we can split it on two smaller leaves. Let's fix all bubbles in proper positions. There are different ways to uh, arrange the leaves. Of course we can shape leaves, bend them. The flower would uh, look better if I point leaves up. Yes, that's better. Um, what else? Uh -huh. uh, we can uh, wave uh, leaf bubbles uh, between each other. This way it's um, back view and this is a front view of the flower. Fix the stem inside of the leaves. Congratulations, we have made the flower. Let's make a bouquet of slightly different flowers. Inflate a balloon leaving about 
4 inch flat tail. Twist a chain of two soft uh, one inch bubbles. Lock both ends of the chain of the first two bubbles in one lock twist. Lock all ends of the first two bubbles in one lock twist. Twist the third soft one inch bubble. Lock both ends of the third bubble in one lock twist. We can fix these bubbles in different positions. It is not very important. The rest of the flower we are going to make um, basically in the same way as we did the first flower. We will twist two sets of petals. So let's start with uh, long petals. Squeeze the balloon to make it soft. Make sure to leave up to one inch flat tail. Fold the balloon four times to find the size of the petal, long petal. Twist the fourth bubble. Fold the balloon to measure the size of the fifth bubble and twist it. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Measure the sixth bubble and twist it. Lock the free end of the sixth bubble between the fourth and the fifth bubbles. We have made the set of three long petals. The first three small bubbles we twisted. Um, it's kind of an extension for the long petals. Ok, now we are going to make a set of three short petals. Twist the seventh bubble. Twist the eighth bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. The rest of the balloon is the ninth bubble. Use a teeny flat tail at the end of the balloon to lock the free end of the ninth bubble between the seventh and the eighth bubbles. We have made a set of three short petals. Let's fix the short petals inside of the set of long petals. We have made the blossom. Inflate a green balloon to make a stem. Leave about two inch flat tail. Lock the nozzle of the green balloon uh, between uh, pink bubbles at the bottom of the blossom. Twist the first about seven inch green bubble. We don't need so long flat tail. So let's squeeze the balloon. I'm going to make two leaves. Twist the second about 13 inch green bubble. Twist the third. Same size 13 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two green bubbles in one lock twist. And now we lock all ends of the last two green bubbles in one lock twist. We have made two leaves and the rest of the green balloon is the bottom of the stem. Bend the leaves to shape it properly. We have made very pretty flower. Let's wave the leaves around each other. Fix the stem inside uh, between the leaves. Congratulations again. We have made the second flower. Let's put the flowers together in one bouquet. The bouquet would look even better if we put it in a vase. 
I don't have time to make a vase, but I do have time to make another flower. Inflate a balloon leaving about 4 inch flat tail. Once again I'm going to make basically the same flower. Twist a chain of first two soft 1 inch bubbles. Lock all ends of the first two bubbles in one lock twist. Twist the third soft 1 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the third bubble in one lock twist. We have made extension for one set of petals. This time uh, it's gonna be the short petals. Squeeze the balloon to make it soft. Keep uh, about one inch flat tail at the end of the balloon. Fold the balloon four times to measure the size. One quarter. This quarter of the balloon we're going to split on three bubbles to make a set of three short petals. Twist the fourth. Twist the fifth bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Twist the sixth bubble. Use the bird body twist to lock the free end of the sixth bubble between the fourth and the fifth bubbles. We have made a set of three short petals with little extension for it. Fold the rest of the balloon three times. It is the size of the long petal. Twist the seventh, twist the eighth bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Lock the free end of the ninth bubble between the seventh and the eighth bubble. We have made a set of three long petals. Inflate a green balloon leaving about two inch flat tail to make the stem. Tie the nozzle of the green balloon to the flower. Fix the short petals inside between uh, long petals. Hide the nozzle between bubbles. This time I want to make um, stem with um, three leaves. Twist the first green about five inch bubble. I have no idea why did I make so long tail again. That's okay. Let's squeeze the balloon to get rid of the flat tail. I'll fold the balloon four times to find the size of the leaf. Twist the second green bubble. Twist the third green bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two green bubbles in one lock twist. Twist the fourth green bubble. Lock the free end of the fourth green bubble between the second and the third green bubbles. Lock all ends of the last three bubbles in one lock twist. We have made the leaves. And again, congratulations, we have made a flower. We can uh, fix the leaves in different ways. Again, uh, let's wave them around each other. We can leave one side of the flower open, as we did with two leaves. Uh, with three leaves we can actually wave all the way around. So far we have made three flowers. All three flowers we made in the same fashion, the same style. Uh, let's put the flowers next to each other. It's hard for me to say which one is the winner of the beauty contest here. Have fun and happy twisting.